Lawmakers in Rhode Island considering legislation that would essentially eliminate life without parole sentences for juveniles, a change that would affect how long juveniles can spend behind bars before they're eligible for parole. I would assume reporter Abby Burke has the story now. That's new at 530. Currently, if a juvenile is tried as an adult in a murder case and found guilty and sentenced to life in prison, they must serve 25 years before they have a chance at parole. But now there's a bill that's trying to reduce that time served down to 15 years. We want to keep murderers behind bars. It doesn't matter what the age is. Senator Lou Raptakis worked several years to successfully get a bill passed in 2015 that increased time served for a life sentence from 20 to 25 years before a convicted murderer can go before a parole board. That crime had to be an outrage, had to be a heinous crime. So we've got a punishment that fits it. But to go backwards now, where we're saying anyone under 18 years old, what are we doing? We're giving them a free pass. Senator Harold Met says it's not a free pass. But he wants Rhode Island to follow 19 other states with similar legislation that decreases time served to 15 years for juveniles who commit murder. Everybody is moving in this direction and it's, it's time for Rhode Island to get on board. The former educator and deacon believes teens don't fully think about the consequences. Whether it's from peer pressure being in gangs and they were influenced at 14, 15, 16, whatever, whatever it was, they have a chance and, it, and it's been proven through psychological evidence. Met says serving 25 years before getting a chance at parole diminishes any hope of turning life around. Well, if, if I know I'm going to get life and why there's no there's no reason for me to do well. Metz adds the chance for parole is contingent upon good behavior and only if the parole board is willing to take up the case. But Raptakis argues the bill jeopardizes public safety. Well, I think we're playing Russian roulette with the public. I mean, this is a dangerous precedent. The bill was considered by the state Senate, but Raptakis doesn't think it will pass. In the control room, Abby Burke, Eyewitness News.